I'm so glad you're here because I'm a huge fan. Oh, thanks. And you were brilliant, I should say, well, before we talk about the movie, which you're also brilliant in, at Breaking Bad. You were so fantastic. Well, thank you. You know, I, uh, I heard that you were a fan, and so I wanted to bring you a little, a little gift for your, your coffee table. It's oh. just a little snack. Some milk? You know, just, um, oh, yeah. Because I was yeah. getting a little tired, so. Oh, it's, it's very good. Oh. Mm. That's some good mm. mess. That is some good yeah. mess. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> we have some for everyone in the mm. audience. It would be rude not to. Yes, I know. So rude to not offer meth to everybody. Exactly. <laughs> wow, that is some uh, sugary stuff. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> we were selling it on, on the show for a little while, because it's Ellen Blue. It's the same color. It's your so color. So we, we were packaging it, and we were selling it on the show. It didn't really... Um, <laughs> How did, um, yeah. how were sales? Didn't do well, maybe didn't do it, well. Maybe it was a marketing campaign that yeah. needed to be revamped. Too many people losing their teeth and yeah. not coming back. That's, a, that's, that's yeah. not good for sales. Um, I have to say congratulations to you. Uh, first of all, David Beckham is the sexiest man alive. But, yes, he is. But. You know what? I've met David a couple times. The first time I met him, I went, oh my God, you are the sexiest man. He is. He really is. He drips. Sexy. He, he, he oozes sexuality. Mm -hmm. He is for sure, you can't argue with that, but sexy at every age, and it starts at the 20s, and it cuts off at 59, and you barely squeak in there <laughs> at 59. Uh, <laughs> so when someone, when someone just showed me this, and I went, oh, wow, look at that, I'm at 59. Let's see who's 60. <laughs> There isn't any. No. I'm like, so that's it. That's it. I, I'm going out with a bang. Yeah. 59. First of all, I want to say, seriously, you are sexy. And this oh, is long, a long time coming, because there's a picture of you that <laughs> I'm... I don't know why it took them so long. You know, yeah. <laughs> That's the uh, that's the foldout inside uh, People magazine. <laughs> like wow. Yeah. Um, thank you for that. Yeah, you're welcome. Um, all right, let's let's talk about the movie. So you uh, and by the way, you're naked in this movie also. Yeah. You're you're. Always... I have the worst agent in the world. <laughs> uh, you know, I said we need to have a nudity clause, and they put it in, but they put it in backwards. That, yeah. I'm I'm nude in they, everything. They I thought have. you were asking like, for it. Yeah. Um, uh, but it's really you nude in there. It's the back of you, but it's really you. Yeah, but I had to do a whole full frontal thing. It, we shot it with the whole thing. It was nerve-wracking. Why? That's a good question. Yeah. <laughs> um, well, this, this is a story of, about... Uh, yeah, a, tell people what's about it. Trumbo, uh, Dalton Trumbo was a, a, a very uh, high-paid uh, screenwriter in the 1940s, in fact, the highest paid. He wrote beautiful works, uh, and eventually he wrote uh, Roman Holiday and Spartacus and Exodus, Papillon, um, it, some really wonderful films, but he was blacklisted in the, in the 40s, from 47 to 1960. He wasn't able to, to use his own name because he was a member of the American Communist Party. So he was stripped of his, um, of his physical freedom, he was stripped of his dignity, his, his ability to follow his own uh, career path and, and being responsible for yeah. his wife and children. So when we got to the scene where we're shooting in the jail, we thought, you know, this is really going to be important to see a man completely physically stripped of everything. So I said to Jay Roach, our director, I said, you're never gonna find uh, volunteers to say, yeah, I'll be naked, completely naked and shoot everything. I had to do it, yeah, you know, right. but, um, so they said, well, who would like to be naked in a cell with Brian Cranston? It's like, yeah, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Like, we had our pick. There were yeah. five or six other guys completely naked. I'm like, okay, all right. And by the way, all men are not created equal. Oh. <laughs> <Good to know. laughs> oh, you're very funny. Um, we have to. Uh, I wouldn't know, but we're going to take a break. <laughs> 